Hello, hello, and welcome back to the Fan Hyper Channel. It's me, John. We're back again with another Advent Beer Calendar for you. Today, we are going to get a beer from McChesney, Illinois. If you're not sure where McChesney is, neither did I. It is just north of Rockford, Illinois. And this brewery is called Pig Mines Brewing Company. That's pig as in the animal, mines as in your head. Brewing company. <clears throat> and this is what the can looks like. Uh, when I went to their website, which is pigmindsbrewing.com, I found that both this little emblem right here on their head, this pig face, and then this artistic drawing of a pig, uh, is used very much in a lot of their art on their cans. Uh, as you can see, this one is called Jolly Ride, and it shows a pig and a sleigh, and a sleigh is a bird, and there's some music playing. This one's the first one that has this Advent Calendar beer stamp on it. There's other ones that said uh, collaboration with Lodi's Tap House. But this is the first one that actually says that it's an advent calendar beer. Now this is a chocolate cherry red ale, and it is a 6.2% alcohol and volume. It's, a, it's on the back of their cans right there. Another pig has a bird in its head. So maybe like pigs and birds are something that's on everything. I've seen a lot of pig, but I notice there's two birds. Um, in the snowy fields, you can see cherries and what I hope is chocolates. Um, so, like I said, this is uh, McChesney, Rockford. It is a chocolate cherry red ale. Uh, red ale is not a very uh, well-known or common beer variety. Uh, it is in the middle. It's not a dark ale, it's not a light ale, somewhere in the middle, and it's usually uh, grouped in with an amber ales, and amber lagers as well. The most famous that I know of uh, red ale is um, Killian's Irish Red, and it's actually not a red ale, it's an amber lager. Just found that out today. Uh, but the most readily available red ale is probably Sam Adams, who has their own red ale. I don't know why that is so cool. I don't know why it's not focused over here on the ice. Anyway, um, Pig Mines Brewery Brewing Company uh, is also a 100% vegan brew house. Restaurant attached to it, it's all vegan, no animal products used during the processing, brewing, and any of their beers as well. Uh, I think that's all I can say about pig mines. Let's go ahead and open up the can, pour it into this cup, take a picture, then drink it. That's the main way these videos go. Some cracking sound. Let's see just how red this red ale is. Oh, there we go. Pretty, pretty red, I would say. A little bit of sweet smell too, as well. Extra time for the pour. And if it's my own fix, it's a brown. There we go. Done. And now let's go ahead and taste it. Red ales should have, a, uh, from what I read, it's like 
medium everything. Medium roast, medium hop. It's a very mid beer. And this one should have notes of cherry and chocolate. Let's go ahead and try it. There's a bit of a chocolatey miss in the smell. There's definitely a like tart cherry part to this. And then almost like a buttery, cocoa buttery coating of everything in the mouth. So like when it says chocolate cherry, well, they should have said like chocolate coated cherry, chocolate covered cherry, because the chocolate part of this feels like it's coated or covering. And the cherry part is just like flooding off with this tart cherry flavor. It's not super sweet. There's like a very mild sweetness to this. Like just, just a hint of tart, just a hint of sweet, but very much cherry and chocolate. You still get like a, a decent roasty barley kind of flavor to it. There's still some hoppy bitterness to it as well. But you definitely get exactly what it says, chocolate cherry. That's a tasty one. Jolly Ride from Pig Mines Brewing in McChesney, Illinois. I like that one. Let me give you a thumbs up. And We'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe for another day. We have a beer calendar. Me, John, on the Fat Hipster Channel.